This is ridiculous! You've had more than enough time! Why are the calculations still not done? But, but, but Professor, it's impossible to be any more precise with our current equipment. Not even the most cutting-edge engineering science or orbital science will allow for... I will not be told what is or isn't possible by assistance! We knew about an inevitable lack of precision going into this! The theory is complete. Now do your job and find a way to realize it! It's as simple as that! You are working in the finest laboratory in all of Calvert, and it is high time that you started thinking like it. <sighs> Whatever. I'll be back to hear your results in the morning. Just get to making progress! Ah, <sighs> not another all-nighter. I didn't think losing to Professor Cronkite would push him this far off the deep end. I don't disagree, but complaining isn't going to get us anywhere. All we can do is get back to work. wasn't what we agreed. You both gave me your word that you would stay on until the Zypha standard was ready for the general population. Oh, sorry. But my main research really needs my attention right now. I've covered all the tasks I was specifically left with, though. <laughs> As have I. Now it's time I devoted myself to that other project. Unless you would be willing to take responsibility were a problem to arise due to my lack of attention. <gasps> You know I can't do that. Then it seems we've nothing else to discuss. I really am sorry about this. Oh, I need to keep making improvements to that other thing I was given too. Ugh, why must the professor students all be like this? Not to mention the woman herself. If she hadn't just up and left Basel in the first place, this wouldn't be an issue. Meanwhile, Professor Callahan's obsessed with his research into Adios knows what. What? Atwas and Red Star are threatening patent litigation? Then have their legal representative take care of it! Aldra and ZCF have a partnership now? Is this through that tech union? What are the details? Project AF's been leaked? But we had an agreement with Tyrell! It's already time for those... educational visitations? Ugh, I don't have the time for this! <sighs> Why can't problems ever come one at a time? I can't deal with all of this. Wait a second. I may have just worked out the perfect card to play. She left another student back here, didn't she? As I recall, he's become obsessed with that old facility. I knew it! This is the best time of the day to see the Great Shadar Triangle. I just wish there was a little less cloud cover. By the looks of it, their conjunction will be about 10 months from now, so that should do it for my homework. I just hope she'll be back before then. Who will be back? Oh, uh, don't mind me, it's nothing. They said, are you alright? <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. How could I not be when I've got the two of you? And I'm not a child anymore, I can keep things safe in Grand's absence. Adios above. You're too young to always be so serious. Hey there. How's it going so far? I assume you mean with the new lens? I couldn't try it out fast enough. It's accurate to 0 .03 micro arch. The engineers of the artisanal district really are second to none. <laughs> 
wasn't going to settle for less than perfect on one of the professor's homework assignments. But I was really asking about you. You sure you're not working yourself too hard lately? I'm fine. Honestly, I am. But thank you for always caring about me. It means a lot, especially since I'm sure you already have your hands full with work from above as it is. Oh, I won't hear a word of that. You just leave worrying about that kind of stuff to me. Everyone's got their role to play in the world, whether it's as a researcher or as an engineer. And we wouldn't be fit to call ourselves artisans of Basel if we weren't willing to come help the professor's favorite student. Well, uh, thank you very much then. Oh, excuse me. Mr. Towsend? What could the CEO want with someone like me? What? Hold on a second. What do you... But th this is the professor's... I'm on my way. Ugh. What nasty crap is Towsend up to this time? Of course! Her most well-known achievements are the Calvardian Constitution, which guides us to this day, and Edith's designation as our capital. However, I think that the founding of this very academy also deserves a special mention. The opinions of a great many thinkers, including her comrade, the artist Aramis, were reflected in its creation. But even the Royal Academy in neighboring Liberal, and a military academy in Arabonia, our enemies at the time, served as inspirations. RMS was founded to be a place where people of all races, nationalities, and beliefs could come together for the benefit of all. And I believe that as a result, it is a perfect embodiment of the ideals upon which our Republic was established. Stiff competition, huh? Shush! Pay attention to the lesson! Yes, sir. Stand. Bow.
Sounds like someone's having fun in here. The same to you. I'll be doing a bit of visitationing myself, incidentally, since I enrolled this year. If we end up going to the same place, I'll do what I can to help with your lodgings. By the way, I think it's fine to leave your decision until the last minute if you're that concerned about your work-school balance. Actually, I know a few too many people there for that to be a good choice. I visited Longport and Arasi on Plenty too, and Tharbad isn't quite as enticing with the festival over. No, I've made my mind up to go somewhere else entirely. A city that's like no other for experiencing both Calvert's history and its innovation, filled with wisdom and technology. A place where you can see the future of the Zypha Standard, the Orbal Network, and so much more. I read your report. I'm pleased to see everything seems to be going swimmingly. I foresee no major issues in you conducting your support and operational work from Edith. As such, I will leave all but emergency matters to your discretion while you're with Arkride Solutions. Thank you very much. I will continue to report all I can regarding the Almada matter too, aside from the agreed exceptions. Please do. Although I can't help but feel that much will fall under the exceptions umbrella. I do apologize about that, however. Oh, I didn't mean to sound critical of you. This arrangement doesn't violate the terms of our agreement in any way. I'm just sure you appreciate that we cannot allow complete free reign a la a certain society's agents. Of course. That degree of freedom would not befit a corporate setting. Now, I am very interested in the actions of Van Arkride and his personal hollow. Just as much as I anticipate perusing your own data from your time there. I'm counting on you, Ms. Twinings. I will not disappoint you, Mr. Thorndike. Our Duke truly is an enigma, even to those in it like me. They prioritize profit above all else, but also use a perfect mixture of truth and lies to blur just how far their reach really extends. But I suppose I'm in no position to decry that. Well then, it's time I started work for today. <laughs> oh, there you are. Someone's in a good mood today. Hey, done with school for the day? I sure am. Are you doing some maintenance before work? You're so dedicated. My girl only deserves the best. I threw in a bonus on top of your base reward, so you have something extra to look forward to. It will arrive separately.
I thought I might find you here, Van. And hello, Fairy. Um, yes! You always get here ten minutes early. I don't mind you being a little more lax, you know. <laughs> I'm sure you don't, but it's a hard habit to break once you've started. <sighs> Guess that means I can hit the hay a while longer, then. You should try taking a page or two out of her book, Mr. Serial Nightcrawler. Hey, what I do in my free time's my business, Chief. <laughs> you do know it's almost noon. Yeah! Almost noon! I'm glad to see everyone gathered. Now get some grub and get out of here before the lunch rush hits. Get out of here! Thanks a bunch! Let's go eat, guys! Sure thing. Man, any more people and we won't know where else to put them. <laughs> Maybe, but I think it's nice.
Activating Virtual Combat Simulator, Beta Version. I hate getting sweaty, but I could get used to this. The steam feels quite pleasant. <laughs> I feel fully refreshed after that.
Alrighty. Quit dawdling and buy something. <laughs> Come back. What'll it be, hun? See you again! What's on the menu? Be seeing ya. Why not take some flop? Say, why not take some flowers with you? I hope I see you again. What's next? <laughs> I'll take very good care of it. Looking is always free, you know. Come back for more anytime. Kids are always so full of energy. Welcome. Thanks for stopping by.
see you again soon. Do you know what you want? I hope to see you again. Do you know what you want? I hope to see you again. Time to depart. Well, if it isn't Van... I'll take your order. Come back and play soon. Now then. Oh, good stuff right here. Take as long as you need. I'll be waiting for you. Time to depart. I can handle any maintenance. I'm ready to help whatever you need. Actually, what to do?
On my way. For real? Is it just me, or has the lighting been acting up for a bit? Has it? I don't know. It was working fine this morning. Whoa! The lights went out! Hey, come on! I can't see a thing! Get those lights back! Ah! Lance? Why? <sighs> huh? Emily? Is that you? Blood! Hey! Emily! Something happened to Le- Come play with me, Joshua. 